Hey guys, Harv here, and welcome back to the Kerbal Space Program Test Pilot. This is the series of videos in which we take viewer submitted ships and test them out to see how just how good my community is at making ships. This is actually the finale of season one. We're going to move on to making it into a proper show, but that will be in the next episode. I told you that I would be landing a VTOL on the HMS Hood, and that is exactly what we're going to do. This is the Leapfrog, submitted by Hayden Hausman. Or H H Hausman, I think that's right. Hayden Hausman. Thank you very much for your submission. 31 parts with one stage. It is a VTOL in the way I build them with two lateral pointing down engines and one engine pointing forwards. Well, this is the way I used to build them, um, or at least it's, it's remotely similar. I haven't built a VTOL. I haven't built a VTOL in a long while. So, maybe first time, I don't know, I somehow doubt it'll be first time, but we're going to try land this on the HMS hood. There's actually two next to each other, so if I destroy one but the other remains intact, then, well, <laughs> we'll try it. Put the brakes on. Um, action group one turns on the VTOL engines, as I've been told. We have plenty of fuel, plenty of fuel, and let's see just how well balanced is this. Not going to touch the keyboard. Not touching it whatsoever. And yeah, that's good enough. Okay, bring down the throttle. No, oh, well, that's tipping backwards, isn't it? Don't tip backwards. Okay, backflip. Go on, you can do a backflip. No, you can't do a backflip. <laughs> that didn't go so well. Um, okay, let's restart that. Right. Uh, this time, lean forwards, Harvey. Let's see if we can lean forwards. In fact, I want to take a look at this in Spaceplane Hangar. I want to see where the centre of mass is. But I'll have one more go before I do that. So, quick save, so I can actually just quick load if anything goes wrong. Uh, number one on. And launching. I'm going to do it only half throttle. Okay, should have enough thrust to actually lift us off the ground. There we go. Uh, uh, uh. Yep, yeah. now number two turns that on. And we can turn, or well, put the throttle up, put the gear up for now. And we'll turn the VTOL engines off. Yes. Okay, right, that's a VTOL, certainly. Okay, where is the HMS Hoods? Over there. Now, we got a bit of lag in the splitter video. The SR98 splitter. So, hopefully we won't get so much. Oh, there we go. There's the freezing. Ah, don't give us loads of lag. Okay, I think we might be okay. I might have to end one of the flights if there's too much lag. Uh, swap back over to the VTOL engines. We're going to bring this in. Right. Hopefully. Hopefully we'll be linked in. Now I've got to try and use this like a helicopter because that's more it's more of a helicopter than a plane, certainly. Um tip backwards a bit to cancel out forwards velocity. Not too much. I don't want the same thing to happen. Why are we rising? We should be falling, damn it. Okay, we're pretty much directly overhead. Now is the ship big enough? That might be a concern. Whoa, we are tipping forwards. And we're getting lag. Hmm, this is going to be hard. I didn't think about how hard this was actually going to be, did I? Okay, well, it's directly below us, at least. Okay, no problems. Just keep putting up the throttle and putting it back down. Oh, we've lost the markers. Damn it. Okay, up. Up, 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 up. up. Forwards, forwards. That way. Yes, plane. Yes, that way. There we go. <laughs> Kerbal Space Program, ladies and gentlemen. Right. Flown by an inept pilot. I don't... I'm not a pilot. I'm a rocket person. Ah. Okay. Okay. If we crash, but on it, that still counts. That's the rule. Go backwards. Go backwards, Harvey. 
backwards and up 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 and well well at least the pilot survived and he can swim over and join the HMS HUD okay we're going to end this flight um, can't I just close that? No. I saw someone close it once after ending a flight. I don't know how they did that. Uh, go to the tracking station. And we are going to get rid of one of those HMS HUDs. Um, HMS HUD Mark II and HMS HUD. Call it HMS HUD. We'll get rid of that. Um, there we go. HMS HUD Mark II. Right. Let's go into the spaceplane hangar and see where the center of mass is on this VTOL. Um, and the moment of truth is pretty much with the center of lift. Yes, that's absolutely fine. Okay. Ah, uh, but is it? Yes, and it's also where the engines are. Okay. So it's definitely well balanced. It's definitely well balanced. It's just my inept piloting. Yeah. Go on, I've got to do this. I'll be a failure if I don't, certainly. It's been like six and a half minutes already. Okay. Right. If I don't do it after 20 minutes, then... <laughs> yeah, I don't know. We'll see. Oh, actually, turn... Um, this is... No, it's a VTOL, damn it. It's a VTOL. Damn it. Oh, well, screw it. I like... I like uh, not using a VTOL. <laughs> uh, yes, I'll use it as a VTOL next time we launch. Don't worry. Um, turn off those for the time being. No, nope, I mean those. There we go. That's better. Uh, we're going to come in low this time. That's our plan of attack. Um, or our attack plan. And we're actually going to just glide. This thing's got a pretty good glide profile, so it's not a problem. Just a couple of kilometers away. Oh, we're dangerously close to the ground. There we go. It doesn't turn or doesn't tilt so well. Uh, there we go. There's lag. Tip up. Oh, we lost... Yeah, we lost parts. Okay. Right. Um, note to self. You can't do space planes. <sighs> Take three. End flight. Restart flight, because I didn't quick save like an idiot. <sighs> okay, there we go. Right. Taking off like a VTOL, and this is the one. This is the one. Quick saving. Uh, engines on. And thrust up to max. Don't need advanced SAS. Advanced SAS for losers. Left in the gear. And we'll turn on. No, no, wait. I, t I pressed the wrong button. God damn it. <sighs> right. Quick loading. Okay. One is for the engines. And two is for the normal engine. Harvey. Okay, right. Take three. Or four. I, I forget. No, I just said it. There we go. Up. Forwards. Onwards. And other such words. Right. Now we turn on the next engine. And we turn off that, those engines. Perhaps a bit too soon, but I think we're okay. Yep, we're fine. Okay, not coming in as low as we did just then. Uh, not quite that low, but certainly fairly low. As I turn the mic towards me a little. Um, okay, a bit low, and not that low. Okay, turn off the engine. We can glide. Uh, we get the lag. Okay. Yeah, that music, that music.
So, uh, yes, we're here, and we are very, very close to the boat. Very, very close. This is post-commentary, because um, I finished up recording, and actually failed. Uh, and I edited the video, put it together, failed, I felt annoyed with myself, and then I thought, this is just like that flight to the target. This I was disappointing, I failed at the end, I crashed, just, oh, there's a crash. Um, yes, so, no, I decided, no, I'm not going to. I like how I hit the boat and it just sails away on that one. That's pretty funny. But um yes, no, I'm going to I'm going to do this. I went back to it. So <laughs> just mucking about in the water. I managed to quick save uh, in the water next to it so I can just quick load immediately like this. And I I nearly nearly get on it. Just fly up, fly down. No, maybe not. Okay. Okay. Very close. Just got to go forward a little and upwards. Uh, there we go! On! That's it! Look at it! Look at it! P picture! That's a picture we are on, we are landed... Okay, maybe we didn't land perfectly. But to be honest, what do you expect from a boat that's a V-shape? It's not going to stay upright, is it? So yes, that's it, we landed. Um, uh, it took me about two hours to do in total, with, I think, 27 near attempts. About 50 in total, just crashing on the runway. But yes, that's it. Um, that's the end of Season 1. Thank you very much for watching. If you liked the video, please do like the video. Thanks again for watching, and I shall see you all next time.